All right, so here is the winner's finals from the Geekery Store Championship on November 20th, 2016. On the left is Chris D playing Rebirth Obelis Val, and on the right is Kenny playing IG again, so I guess he's not going to get to play IG again <laughs> in his next game. Uh, and Jason's still here. He hasn't left yet. Yay. <laughs> this game, if you can't tell from the time on YouTube, is way short. <laughs> right, so... This is a, a sort of optimal IG game. Um, he gave it away. You're going to see. It could have been a run or win. It could have just been agendas on top. It but now, been now everyone knows. Top. Right. <laughs> but this is, you're going to see the true might of IG here. Um, and the true might in, as compared to what was the old prison IG. This is not your prison IG. It um, can go fast and wants to go fast. All right. All right. Let the game however long it may be, begin. Yeah, and so these are both extremely fast players, as you can see. Yeah, uh, I think that the game would have been a little bit longer if they were playing a little more slowly. Right. Um, Chris knows this deck. Me, Chris, uh, Hinks, and Kenny have all practiced against this deck many times, had died to it many times. Um, so he probably knows it card for card at this point. Um, so, you know, he has a strategy, and Kenny has a strategy as well. Um, Kenny knows that this Val is a Siphon Val. Um, if Chris can get Siphons off and have that Obelisk fire, um, obviously if you get he'll the have Obelisk a would, The cards. Obelisk would give him an enormous hand of cards right. and be, be unkillable, basically. Right, and then so he that, can medium him to death. So that cannot happen uh, for IG. Right. All right, so he goes. So the bad pub from Val is actually helping a little bit here. It's not quite wizard, but it's better than nothing. Sure. And obviously, if he finds a rebirth, he's going to be rebirthing the wizard right. and controlling board state. Um, oh, the sense he's gone too. All right. How much money? He sure gambled, so he, did, he has some money left. I think he has four credits left. Right. Using dice, which are illegal in New York. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. New York is a dice zone. <laughs> It's like going to Colorado or Washington to get some weed. He comes to come to New York to play Netrunner with dice. Trash. Okay, <laughs> so now he has no credits, which is tough. But we see that. Um, well, he's well, got a scrubber. A lot of what he has in hand, he probably doesn't want to put down. Yeah. Eventually, I think the Faust is playable um, when he's got Obelis. Yeah. Um, but before that, I think he runs three Faust. That's like his main. His main deal. Right. But at least it takes up an MU, right? If he knows the deck card for card, he knows his Cortex lock. Yes, correct. He sees Bioethics. He's got the Scrubber and the, and yeah, the Val. Yeah, he's going to want to trash it. He does. Yeah, mo but he oh, has to think about... Are there two face-down cards there? Uh, Yes. Oh, but he spent the money. Okay. Right. So he, we see that he has Day Job in hand. He's going to want a Day Job at some point. Oh, um, you just threw out a blackmail. You don't need that. No, don't need that. All right, Kenny puts down three face-down cards. Perfect for IG. Um, he oh, has food. food. All right. Free food. Chair. Psychic Fields. Psychic Fields. So he sees one Psychic Fields. Uh, now he knows that Psychic Fields in, in his hand. Kenny again putting down three face downs. Well, you know that there's probably a one third chance of hitting Psychic Field in one of those three cards, right? right. Yeah, for so sure. Are you going to take that chance? No, he, play, he played Day Job to get money because he was only down to three credits. Now he's got a bunch. Oh, so Hero and. He's got to set up already six cards. Right, so that's, that's three it. credits. He has got three credits. And now does he have the Ronin on the board? That's he has up. to miss. He has to miss. I've had worse here. He does. He hits David instead. That's it. Yep. Boom. That's it. Game over. Slam. <laughs> that's all it takes. Oh, there was a psychic field in the back. And and the uh, fetal. The fetal. The so fetal just would have done it. So too. he had a one. So even if he ran, he had a one out of two shot of big mistake. Yeah, he's looking for siphon. He's only got two siphons in his deck. I don't know. He but you know, running. Him. I guess was you know you think about running was a fifty percent chance of losing, but not running was a hundred percent chance of losing. Right. Right. So should have run and seen something. The day job took his whole turn. Well, the only thing that he could really trash are the bioethics. Yeah. And That's the Ronin. Mm. Maybe. Oh, we're out of time. <laughs> okay. 